Hey y'all, what is up? Welcome back to another plan with me. How is everybody? How was your week? I hope it was good. This week I am memory planning for the 13th to the 19th of December. This week, for some reason, was very difficult for me. I was very tired, but I went into it quite hopeful. I actually went into this week thinking that I would use my memory spread as my actual planner spread. I didn't. I ended up making myself some inserts. I will put those linked down below. They're free. They're just in my Google Drive. So if you want to print them, they are on Silhouette Studio. That's the program I know how to use. That's a program, you know, I like. So they are on Silhouette Studio. It is a free software that you can download if you are so inclined. So I did really set this up as a planner this week. I put in all of my school days and I put in birthdays and different appointments and things like that. And yeah, I really enjoy this kit from Paper Crown Planner. It's either from last year or the year before. I can't remember. It is an older one. I just love the 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 super deep colors of it. Like the red and green are, su are super deep red and green, and I really enjoy them. The green is almost like a teal. And this is just me looking for some washi. I did decide on this gray with the hollow bows. I just thought it would give it like a little bit of a pop of color. And it, it looks really good with the finished spread. None of my reds or teals really matched. So I just decided let's do the gray. The hollow foil looks really good with it. You know, let's, let's not break it if we don't need to. <laughs> So yeah, this is my regular setup that I have been doing that you guys have been seeing. I originally only had four days at school. I did end up with all five days at school because I went and asked if anybody wanted a day and somebody took me up on it. So <laughs> it's so funny that I put that yellow back because I end up going back for it, which is hilarious. So just going to do my sidebar and my bills. Two bills this week. It was payday, which is really awesome. They are all cut up on payday, which is lovely. Full box on the weekend. I love this full box. It's really cute. I did have to cut it down. I don't know why it wasn't cut in the middle, but that's fine. I can cut it down really easily. And I think my video is going to cut off which is super weird so there might be a weird jump I guess I didn't realize it did that so I'm sorry about that but you will see where I ended up after this weird jump all right y'all so I am going to talk uh like regularly through the rest of this video because honestly it's easier to edit okay so, figured out what time my husband had hockey. Tuesday, it was actually canceled because we have new regulations and it's canceled until further notice because they don't want um, like two sports teams together. So we'll just put a canceled sticker. Monday, school, and then I went to the gym. I was a good little girl for one day, went to the gym for one day. Because, you know, I don't, why, why, why did I not bring this one out? I don't know. Is there boxes on this one? There's boxes on this one. Okay, I want this shoe too. Okay. All right. So I went to the gym on Monday. This is probably the last memory planner spread I'm going to do in this book because I'm using my Hobonichi Cousin inserts that I made and I'm really, really enjoying that and I'm doing that with stickers so I don't need to like double sticker plan the week. That's a lot of stickering and I don't need to do that. So I think this will be my last memory pl plan spread just for now, like while I'm enjoying like planning my week out with stickers, so.
All right, I'm gonna put a to-do list. And then do I have a countdown in here? I thought for sure I did. I wanna put a countdown sticker there. My countdown sticker is from PD, PDM Prints, PD Print and Plan, something like that. Okay, so gym to-do list. I went to the gym, I ran on the treadmill. So many dishes. Oh, this is the day that I printed my DIY Hobonichi and I have fold laundry on there, but I didn't do it until Friday, so we're just gonna leave it. Um, Thursday, I came home and I did a few things and that's about it. This week was really hard for some reason, like I was just really tired. And I just, I, I, I really didn't do much. Okay, and I'll leave a little space for my countdown. Wednesday, I actually did have school. Actually. Oh, uh, what color do I want? I feel like this color would actually look really good. It's kind of the same color as the glitter headers so we'll do that this like yellowy color yeah I was gonna take Wednesday off but then I was like eh. and I went up to the English office and I was like do you guys do you guys have any days and one of the English te teachers was like yeah I'll, like I'll take a day so all right fold laundry I'm gonna put this up here because for some reason I left a big space probably because I was going to take the day off. Oh, I don't didn't mean to write this. Fold laundry, Sobies. I did not fold the laundry. I did go to Sobies though. Um, and we picked up our wedding book, which is really super cute. Okay, and then we had planned to go to Costco on Wednesday, but because my husband's hockey was canceled, we just went on on Tuesday which was nice because it was actually like not super duper busy. I want an arrow sticker, but I can't find one. Okay, yeah, so we picked up our wedding photo book. We picked up some other photo books too, but. Photo book, for some reason I can't write today. Yeah, okay. Um, we had family dinner. No, we didn't. We decorated the Christmas tree. Wow. It just shows you, like, basically in my planner, I do not stick anything down unless I know for sure that we're doing it. Because when you stick your plan, like, you can throw a canceled sticker or an arrow or whatever, but... And I originally, last week, when I planned out this week, I was planning on actually using this as a planner for the week. And then I ended up making myself um, a Hobonichi. So we had family dinner this night. We did go over to my parents and decorate their tree, though. We surprised my mom, my aunt, and I. We were going to set up her tree, like while she was gone. Cause she went to a conference uh, the week before and my aunt had mentioned it to her like, oh, we, I offer free setup or whatever. And mom was like, oh my God, I would have loved that. And she was like, well, we were going to, but Nick said you liked setting up your tree, which in my defense, I thought she did like setting up her tree. So. She usually does. She said she usually does, but when I'm home, she likes it. When I'm not home, she said it's not as fun when I'm not there, so. Okay, empty dishwasher. I baked my grandmother a pie this day. I needed to make sure because we were having supper the next day. Um, and literally, that's all we did. We relaxed all morning. We slept in. We went to my grandmother's for dinner. Nothing else. That's all we did. I totally could have put this weekend sticker up here. 
Um, and then on Sunday, I woke up and I was like, you need to get up and go do some movement. It will make you feel better because I haven't been able to sleep in. So I woke up, went on the elliptical for 15 minutes, and then I did some yoga, which I really enjoyed. So I'm, I'm doing this Monday after school because I, we were busy last night. We, we really weren't, but we were relaxing together and I didn't want to sit down and do this. <laughs> so I got up, I did elliptical and yoga and then Toby's Dollarama Canadian Tire. We did some errands that night for a couple things. We bought a new vacuum, which I'm very excited for. Uh, I'm in the process of buying glass jars for all of like my baking stuff and some of my cooking stuff because I'm sick of having like, if it's in a bag or something, we'll put like a clip on it or in a baggie or whatever. And I would just love for it to be in a glass jar where I know it's not gonna go stale. I was at RMS all week. Um, I did have some weekly to do's. So after moving fold laundry, like literally three days in a row, I put it on my weekly to do. I did get it done. I did not do tarot at all this week, um, which I think I'm just going to put it on the back burner until January. I did, I cleaned the microwave clean micro. I changed the sheets. How often do you guys change your sheets? Like what's normal? I worked on my hobos basically all week. And then I did my 2022 planner lineup video, which should be going out on Wednesday. Hopefully you guys will see this on today, Monday, because it's much easier to edit when I'm just like talking. Yeah, and I'm done. And I'm gonna put in the weather here, which is my weather stickers are in here like that. Okay. So on Friday we had sun and clouds, high of six, low of minus four. And then Saturday minus one, minus five. And Sunday we had snow, which it is still here. And it, there, there's a weather advisory actually for Wednesday which sucks because I always wish for a green Christmas. It's it's just, it's easier to travel. We, we go to quite a few places, although this year we are hosting one, but we go to quite a few places and usually we're going down country and the roads are worse down there. So I really, I do actually wish for a green Christmas like every year. So probably won't get my wish. So here is my memory spread. The thing I like about the memory planner is that I can use different kits. So like the week, this is the kit I used this week. And then in the memory spread, I used this one. So you can use different kits, right? And then like next week I have this kit. These are two kits from this year from Paper Crown Planner. Um, and then the, the, the next week I was going to use my white Christmas kit, which I really, really love. It is this one. It's so pretty. I love it. So you might see another memory spread from me. I don't know yet. I really haven't decided as of right now. It's a no, but I'm, I might get the urge. So, you know, just might. So that is it for my memory plan with me guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. My Kinbor A5 review is out on Wednesday. So be sure to check into that. I think you guys are going to like this, especially if you like my memory planner or the Hobonichi cousin. So I will see you then. Hopefully. Thanks so much for watching y'all. Bye.